What is going on boys? It is your boy Yakubo and today I'm going to be showing you how in 2021 you can do the replay buffer and get Fortnite clips or any clips for any game. So whether uh so let's go ahead and get started boys. You obviously need to already have downloaded OBS um and we're using OBS. I can also teach you guys how to do it on Streamlabs, except it's literally the exact same thing. The only thing different between OBS and Streamlabs OBS is that OBS uses less CPU usage, and it also doesn't have the streaming features that um, Streamlabs has. So right now we're gonna go in here. If you have OBS downloaded, don't worry about all this other stuff I have. This is just for recording purposes, but what you're gonna wanna do, because this is all gonna be blank once you open OBS, you're gonna do cl click this plus sign right here click on game capture create new you just click ok and right here you're gonna see this you gotta click on mode and you gotta click capture specific window and for this window you gotta click on here and when you have your game open you can go ahead and click fortnite when client okay now i know it's gonna look weird like like this but hold up watch this watch this um if we go to windowed full screen actually you will see right here that Fortnite gets um, gets bigger uh, and it fits the size of the thing because you have to have in your settings right here for video settings you gotta have for output you gotta have 1920 by 1080 and for video you got to have 1920 by 1080 1920 by 1080 got it okay good okay so let's just minimize this real quick okay once you have this game capture set up this will obviously not be as tiny as the box right here because like i said you're gonna have this full screen but to set up the start replay the replay buffer you want to go into go into settings you want to go want to go into output then go to replay buffer and you can see how many how much you i mean you have to check enable replay buffer but you can adjust the time of the seconds of the replay time and max me maximum memory i just have that set at 512 because clips don't take up much space anyways and 15 second clips for sure do not take up 500 megabytes so that's that's that for that you got to just set it to 15 um that's the basic one but if you're going for like huge huge edit coursing clips maybe like 30 seconds or 60 seconds you would want for audio you just have all that stuff for video all that stuff you already know and then here's the here is where you have to do the hotkeys uh part for the start replay buffer so here, once you scroll down, you'll see replay buffer, save replay. You can choose what whatever key you want. Um, it's really optional for you. I have F9 on. It doesn't really give me any problems. And then, yeah, that's literally it. You just have F9 right here. And you click, you click OK, and nothing in the advanced tab that you need to worry about. And then once you do this, you lit you all you do is start replay buffer. That's all you gotta do. I'm about to play some Fortnite. So I'm, I'm about to go into creative and we're gonna we're gonna try getting a few clips and I'll show you how that works out. Yo, my game is feeling extra laggy. That's probably because there's a bunch of people here, boys. Holy. Let's try killing just killing some with the scar though. Okay, that's embarrassing. Never mind. We gotta get a pump. Watch this. 360. We gotta get a nice clip. Watch this. Wait, how about this? Okay, hold up. No way. Okay, we got that. We got that guy. Okay, boys. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to click F9 on the keyboard, as you can see on my ham can. And let's go. Let's go actually see if we indeed, we indeed did that. We indeed got the clip. Okay, boys. So I'm going into, I'm going into my folders right now. Let's see for a recording and uh, obviously you gotta have replay buffer on because it's really scary when you don't because you can have an insane clip but forget to have replay buffer on so fortnite recording replay right here and See? also you're you gotta get a nice clip watch this Wait, here let me mute this see as you can see we got that clip right there it literally saved really nicely okay so right here um these recording settings that you have this is the settings that will be for the clip. I recommend like 10,000 bitrate, honestly. I'm on a MacBook, could be different for you guys. Um, but yeah, 
that's basically how you just clip stuff in uh in streamlabs honestly not too hard okay that's embarrassing that's embarrassing yeah boys it's not too hard but um that is about it now i'm gonna go ahead and play a little bit more of this and i'll i'll see if we can get a little bit more clips okay boys we are going in this we're gonna see if we can indeed what 200 debt that would have been a clip right there come on what's happening no, like, this guy's so sweaty, like, why do you try this hard? 